The roar of sirens and the rumble of engines could be heard as dozens of motorcycles joined by fire and police pulled into this ice cream shop near Broadheadsville, giving a sailor returning from overseas a hero's welcome home. The Warriors watched riders northeastern Pennsylvania escorted Petty Officer First Class Carrie Raffensperger back to Monroe County as she just arrived back from serving in Afghanistan for seven months. It was here at the shopping plaza in Bethlehem where Carrie got the surprise the motorcycle club was waiting to take her home. It's really overwhelming. It means a lot to have to have the, su the support of the community. Um, I have an amazing family. I have amazing fiance, and I'm just really lucky. And an emotional reunion followed as Carrie hugged members of her family, getting to meet her newborn niece for the first time. For mom June Miller, she's a member of the motorcycle group and says she values everything they do. I'm just so blessed and speechless. I just don't know what to say. It's, I just I love every single one of these guys. I know some of them by name. I know most of them by their faces. But I'm just blessed to have them all here in my family. This isn't the first time this motorcycle group has done something like this for Carrie's family. Her fiance was also deployed overseas, and these guys were here to welcome him home when he returned earlier this month. I told all my friends about the welcome home that Kevin got, and I kind of I wrote it off to you know being around Fourth of July. But I mean, this this goes to prove that you know people will come out and, and support no matter no matter the day. Despite the possibility of wet weather, the group vowed to ride rain or shine. We don't care if we get wet; it's only water. So she endured more while she was deployed till what's a half hour worth of rain. Peggy Lee, Newswatch 16, Monroe County.